Please, would you leave me alone? Give me my money and I'll go. I shan't give you any money. Oh, no, you will. I shall give you a farthing just to spite you. Now get out of here. I have not the pleasure of being either your husband or your fiancé, so please don't make scenes. I don't like them. What? What do you do? You dare to sit down now? I do. I want you out of here. Give me my money. Oh, how angry I am! How angry I am! I don't want to talk to impudent scoundrels. Are you going to go out of here? No? No. No? No. Oh, no. Uh, Luca! Luca! Will you show this gentleman out? Oh, would you mind going out, sir? You've been asked to now. You needn't worry Shut about it. Shut up! Who are you talking to? I'll chop you into pieces. People, fathers, what people? I'm ill. I'm ill. I can't breathe. Where's Dasher? Dasher! Dasher! Pelagia! Dasher! Oh, they've all gone out to pick fruit. There's no one at home. I'm ill. Oh, ah! I want you to get out of it. Can't you be more polite? You! you you're a bore. A coarse bear. A bear than a monster! What did you say? I said you're a bear. A monster! And may I ask what gives you the right to insult me? And what if I did insult you? Do you think I'm afraid of you? And do you think that because you're a poetic creature you can insult me with impunity, eh? We'll fight it out. Oh, little fathers, what people? Water! Pistols. <coughs> do you think I'm afraid of you? Just because you stand there with your big fists and your bull throat, you, you, you bourbon! We'll fight it out. I'm not going to be insulted by anybody. Bear. And I don't care if you are a woman, one of the softer sex Bear. indeed. It's about time we got over the prejudice Bear. that only men need pay for their insults. Devil take it. If you want equality of rights, you can have it. We're going to fight it out. With pistols? Right. This very minute. Th this very minute. My husband had some pistols. I shall bring them here. Oh, what pleasure it will give me to put a bullet into your thick head. The, the devil take you! I'll bring her down like a chicken. I'm not a, a little boy or a sentimental puppy. I don't care if she is one of the softer sex. Gracious little fathers. Do please, do have pity on a poor old man and go away, sir. You frighten her to death and now you want to shoot her. If she fights, that's equality of rights. Emancipation and all that. Here the sexes are equal. I'll shoot her on principle. But what a woman. Devil take you. What pleasure it'll give me to put a bullet through your thick head, eh? How she reddened. How her cheeks shone. She accepted my challenge. My word, it's the first time that I've ever seen... Go away, sir, and I'll always pray to God for you. She is a woman. That's the sort I can understand, a real woman. Not a, a sour-faced jelly bag, but fire, gunpowder, a rocket... I'm almost sorry to have to kill her. Dear, dear sir, do go away. I absolutely like her. Absolutely. Even though her cheeks are dimpled, I, I like her. I'm almost ready to let the debt go. And I'm not angry anymore. Wonderful woman. Here are the pistols. But, uh, before we fight, You'll have to show me how to fire one. I've never held a pistol in my hands before. Oh, Lord, have mercy and save me. Oh, I'll have to go get the coachman and the gardener. Why is this infliction? Come on, this. You see, there are several sorts of pistols. There are Mortimer pistols, specially made for duels. They fire a percussion cap. These are Smith & Wesson revolvers. Triple action. With extractors. These are excellent pistols. They can't have cost less than 90 rubles the pair. You must hold the revolver like this. Her eyes, her eyes, what an inspiring woman. Like this? Yes, like this. Then you cock the trigger and take aim, like this. Put your head back a little, hold your arm out properly. Then you press this thing with your finger and... That's it. 